All right, guys, so here are the winners of my last giveaway. The first one that was chosen by the randomizer is Evan Lowbrunner, and he does get to choose which lot he would prefer. And the second winner is Kimberly or Nicole. I'm not sure which one you'd rather go by, but you guys definitely go ahead and contact me. All my information is in the bottom of the Dropbox. You can either DM me or email me and give me your address, and I'll get your goodies out to you as soon as possible. I appreciate all you guys for sharing and entering, and I hope you you enjoy the demo. Hey there guys, welcome back. Thanks for joining me again for another demo. Okay, so this one is from Happy Place Cosmetics and they're located in the UK. This is their bath bomb dust. This is their Candyland bath bomb dust and this one came to me in a gift box. It was a random act of kindness from Sweet Christine. Thank you so much. This is so awesome. Okay, so this Candyland dust is scented in candy floss, marshmallow, and cupcake. Now, when I unboxed this, I said that this smelled like the lush snow cake scent, and I stand by that. I think that it smells just like snow cake, and I think that it's awesome. So, to me, that's what this smells like. Um, it's got glitter all in it in the dust and it's just really sparkly the unicorns I'm pretty sure that they're soap so I'm going to take them out before I put the dust in the bath and I'm going to put them in a little soap dish on the side of the tub and I'm going to use them when I'm in there and sometimes also bath bomb dust isn't necessarily the best show um, for a demo even though it's one of my favorite products I absolutely love bath bomb dust so I'm gonna also add um, a bath bomb just a small bath bomb from body bomb bomb just to make sure that we have a good show for you guys um, for this demo so let me go ahead and take the little unicorns out and we'll get started with the dust okay so let's just take one last look at this gorgeous stuff it's just super super sparkly and they're all different colors of pink and purple in here just so pretty on the sides and I'm terrible about dumping this stuff in so we'll see how it goes but I'll just try not to dump it all in at once <laughs> but we'll see and this is gonna make me happy like I said this is happy place cosmetics it is just kind of a gloomy overcast day and the weather always kind of like dictates my mood so I know that this bath with this dust is gonna kind of do me right this afternoon put me in a little better mood whoa it's a huge chunk because this smells so nice and sweet and the color I know the color is gonna be really pretty okay so there's some huge chunks in there oh my gosh this smells really really good some really bright pink pieces in here. Cool. And it's going to be sparkly. Oh my goodness. Okay, let's just get it all in there so we can see. Oh my goodness, those are huge. I love this. I love this stuff. I love it. Okay, let's just get it in there. Okay. Okay, and you know, if you guys were to get this, you don't have to use it all at once, but of course, you know that's what I do. So we have some foam on top. It smells really, really strongly. Um, for a scent that's just kind of like creamy and like cupcakey, to me it smells like marzipan and almond. I know that's not really the description, but it just it's really strong. And a lot of times scents like that aren't really strong. Oh, it smells so so good. I'm gonna feel. Um, I'm gonna feel the water. Oh my gosh, it is so soft. There's the bath art over there. Got it a little closer. Like I said, the light in here is not great. Oh, it's super sparkly though. You can see, yep. There's the unicorn glitter sparkle. But I figured doing it like this would be better than pulling the shade down. Super, super sparkly. Now, the bath bomb I'm going to put in here, I swear it's almost a year old. So, it's, it, I don't know if it's going to flow. It's seen better days. I opened the package a really long time ago. So, it's been exposed to the air. Look at all that glitter. It is, um, they sent it in like strawberries and cream, I think. 
So it might add a little fruity note to this. It might add a little color. I'm not sure, but we're just going to add it in there just kind of for a little bit of cocktail effect. But there's a lot of nice foam and cream on top of this water. So let's get back and look at it. That is so nice. And I really, really like that scent. Okay, let me grab the bath bomb and I'll be right back. Okay, so this is the Fizz Nut from Body Bon Bon, and I don't even know if this is on her um, site anymore, if this is in her shop. I, I, I haven't looked, I haven't seen it, but um, it's sparkly too, and it might be, you know, might end up kind of purple, so I just thought that this would be good to put in there. Um, so we'll just, it smells like strawberry candy to me, so I just thought it might add a little bit, but this scent we've got going on is just like nice and strong already, so. Oh my gosh, it's so pretty. Oh, it's just perfect to go in here. It's absolutely perfect. And even though this is old, you know what guys? I wouldn't be surprised at all if it floated. Because all her stuff is just magnificent. So we have all kinds of international stuff going on in this tub right now. We have UK, we have Australia. that went under at all. Oh, that's so awesome. Yay. Yay. That might have been a pretty good idea. What do you know? I don't know if I've ever done a donut before. I don't know that I have. That's pretty cool. Those colors are really pretty right now. And it's really sparkly. Really sparkly. so much I'm so excited sometimes just a little something makes a huge huge difference and it's awesome I love those colors I love the way it's swirling those little bubble trails it's so cool Okay, <laughs> after doing a little acrobatics around my tub to get that footage, I am so pleased with both of these products. So the Happy Place Cosmetics, the water is super, super soft, it's super glittery, and the scent is incredible. The Body Bon Bon gets a gold star as usual. Almost a year later, that bath bomb was awesome. It wasn't huge, it was exposed to the air, for almost a year and it was, I couldn't believe it, it was awesome. So those two together I think were a good idea. It was a hit, I'm impressed. Um, let's go ahead and check out the watercolor. I'm assuming, oh my gosh, oh my goodness at the sparkle. I wasn't expecting it to be that sparkly. 
Oh my goodness, what a treat. What a treat, oh my goodness, yay. Okay, that's awesome. And I thought it would be at least a magenta, more on the purple side, but it is definitely, definitely purple. And crazy, crazy sparkly. Oh my gosh. Okay, well that is so much fun. And that on the sides there, you guys, and then the lighting in here is terrible, like I've already said, but it is just sparkle and moisture because I've already run my finger. See, it just comes right off. My finger along the side, and my tub is super clean. I just cleaned it really, really good, see, um, right before I ran my bath. So that's all that is, so there shouldn't be any kind of mess with that. So let me go ahead and turn on the jets and we'll see if we get any bubbles. I would be surprised if we do though because there is so much moisture in here, but it's also foamy, so we'll see. Hang on one second. definitely have some bubbles. It's more like a creamy froth. Looks very, very soft. That's awesome. Oh my goodness, like a whipped creamy. Oh my gosh. Oh my goodness. And that look matches the scent, if that makes sense. Because it's such a like foodie kind of scent. Okay, guys, well, I'm going to shut these off, and I'm going to hop in the shower just really quick. I cannot wait to get in here, and I'll let you guys know how it was when I get out. See you in a minute. All right, guys, so I am done with my Happy Place Cosmetics Bath Bomb Dust Bath and my little Fizz Nut from Body Bomb Bomb. Now, you can see there is kind of a purple ish pinkish ring around the sides of the tub and there are some little chunks of glitter down in the bottom but I'm not really worried about this ring. I'm just going to go to some clear liquid dish soap. That should always be the first thing you reach for. You don't want to go to any harsh chemicals. You don't want to reach for any bleach or anything abrasive if you don't have to because that will kind of mess up the lining of your tub and it will be more um, porous and susceptible for any kind of staining in the future. So I think that's all I'm going to need, but I'll let you guys know if that doesn't come off that way. But um, I really enjoyed this bath. I did check the ingredients and the bath bomb dust and it had almond oil in it and I love that ingredient. It always makes the water super soft. I love the scent. It was awesome. Um, I didn't really pick up any of the strawberry while I was in there from the little donut, but I really enjoyed the scent of the bath bomb dust. So I hope you guys enjoyed this demo and I will see you back here next time and I will let you know down in the description box how the bathtub cleans up. See you next time. Bye-bye.